Word, word. Had a conversation with a gypsy She tore my world apart Now my universe is shifting See the truth it sort of hurts When it's not what you predicted In this life you gotta expect it Cause it's nothing really given See, What is good? Battle in the Garden Catch us on Twitter Battle in the G On the gram Battle in the Garden What's going on brother? It's a pleasure It's an honor Doing this interview with you You know what I'm saying? See you working Doing a lot of things A lot of great things You know Monumental things and shit uh, How's it going for you my brother? Everything's been good actually. Everything's going in a good direction. Been doing all, putting out a lot of work, doing a lot of little background things now, trying to get things in the right order. Be more organized than it was last year. How long, you know, for the people that know, how long the Seven Tribes been out, you know? We dropped our first group joint probably 2012. December 12th actually. December 12th, 2012 was like when I put out the first record. Then after that, we just like, you know, we took off from there and shit. Just kept it rolling from there. Being at where you at now, do you ever see yourself back then like where you at now and where you heading to? Nah, not really, not in the sense because I wasn't really trying to like, I wasn't even really trying to make music. It was the, the concept, the concept for the whole situation had nothing, to, for me anyways, it had nothing to do with music. You know, it was just trying, I was trying to get a, um, the frame of mind, the, the state of mind that I was in, trying to get it out there in a way where people would, would be susceptible to it, where it's easier to 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 get that information. You feel me? Mm. There's a lot of information that I went out to go look for, but I was trying to make it easier for other people to go, you know, so you could just get it smooth. I was putting on T-shirts, painting colors, geometry, and stuff like that. Like simp like the basics to life. I feel like like the colors, shapes, geometry. So yeah, it comes down to a lot of like old school oh, knowledge that I did from like. Five percent of shit, um, African Babada, Zulu Nation, oh, yeah, Zulu Nation. So that drew that drew you into like making music. Yeah, yeah. Basically, like I, I had a bunch of concepts in my mind that I wanted to put out and be able to get across to people, but I felt like people weren't trying to hear that. Nobody wanted to hear nobody beating them in the head to death with knowledge. You feel me? Or like information. I mean, people were not trying to hear that. So I was like, how can I make it easy for people to? take some information that's needed like you know things that we need for our everyday lives in order to overcome certain situations if you're in a fucked up situation you might this information can help yeah to lead to a better direction in life you feel me um Yo, cast away my dreams, take away this pain inside, elevate my frequencies, help me with this fear and pride. It could be so beautiful if we can just take our time. Eternal, Eternal sunshine, sunshine of the spotless mind. Eternal sunshine of the spotless mind. Express yourself greatly, you know what I'm saying? And, and, I appreciate and, and it. In a human manner and shit. That's definitely respectful, you know what I'm saying? What's your favorite record you've done? My record? Like solo record? Favorite, and everybody got their babies, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, I feel you. You know what it is that, like, my that first project that I did, the Kibo Hiti project, like, I feel like that is, like, embodiment of what I am and shit, and who I am for real. Like, Word. like I try to, I, you know, I guess the one about my son and the one about my mom, those are my two favorite records. That's facts. That's fire. That's my two favorite right. records, too. Yeah, those are definitely my right. favorite records, bro. Like, I love I records put, that it's like, I you put could, like you could feel it. You know what I'm saying? When you feel it, that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, like in that record like, about my mom, I, I spoke about shit that like, like really happened. Any artists outside the group you would like to work with? Whether it be like you know, major artists, you know, oh, indie local. artists, local artists, like who, are, who who people you like you look up to, like who inspires you and shit. You know what I'm saying? I mean, as far as working with people, I pretty much like worked with local artists that I felt like I like. So I pretty much linked up with almost everybody. There's a couple of people yet that I haven't done records with. But we don't really, I, we're not trying to really work outside of the group to keep it from you. Like, that's something that we, we're trying to maintain, like, even in a major uh, scale? Even on a major scale, I mean, like, we're, we're definitely trying to keep it where um, it's not tainted, you feel me? We don't want to taint what we have. The, the, we're, we're brothers, and, and when I need something, I know one of the brothers got it you feel me like usually when you feature somebody on a record you're looking for that person to bring something different to the record that you can't Facts. there's like 10 of us you feel me